my readers of the realm. My name is Shay. Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys had a great weekend. Mine has been fantastic. I did manage to get some reading done and I finished Six Wakes by Mer Lafferty. Here it is. Six Wakes was published in 2017 by Orbit and it is a standalone novel. Six Wakes is a science fiction murder mystery novel that is set in deep space and the year is 2493. The beginning of Six Wakes opens up with our main character, Maria Arena, and she is a janitor forward slash maintenance employee. And she wakes up as a clone and she also wakes up to a murder scene. What's even worse about this murder scene is that the grav drive has been shut off. So Maria is witnessing floating corpses of her dead crew members and the blood and the evidence has been contaminated within the crime scene. Maria also sees her past dead self, which of course deals a lot with the uncanny. Despite all of this horror, the good news is that the crew members have been cloned in the vats, so Maria is able to wake up her new clone members' bodies. Although they are still technically alive, none of the crew members, including Maria, remember anything before the murder happened because their mind maps are missing. Mind maps allow humans to be born again with full memories from their previous clones. So now, Maria and her crewmates must be able to figure out who committed the murder while still fixing the spaceship that has issues before the spaceship dies on them as well. Now, on this spaceship, we have six characters, three male and three female, each of which has a different past, a different background, race, and ethnicity, and each one has a different occupation. But the one thing that they all do have in common is that they are all convicts. What I really liked about the characters from Six Wakes is that these characters remind me a lot of the characters from Agatha Christie's murder mystery novels. Agatha Christie is the godmother to murder mystery novels and what I liked about her characters is that all of them are bad and all of them have something to be guilty of. Six Wakes is also peppered with red herrings, which is another characteristic that you see in murder mystery novels such as Agatha Christie. Six Wakes is a lot like the game Clue, but set in deep space. You have to figure out who is suspect, which weapon did they use, and why did they commit the murder. Another thing that Six Wakes remind me of is Jean-Paul Sartre's French play No Exit, which is famous for its saying, hell is other people. I can definitely see this concept used in Six Wakes, except it's with clones in deep space. The purpose of cloning in this universe is that cloning is meant to extend life, not to duplicate it or to multiply it. For me, cloning is like the cousin of immortality, and Six Wakes does deal with the moral, ethical, and spiritual debates about cloning. Not to mention that the author does some very interesting things with the laws of cloning and its consequences. So without going further into any spoilers, overall I really did enjoy Six Wakes. The only thing that I would have liked to see differently in this book is I would wish that the narrative was switched from third person to first person narrative. It would be more interesting to read this book in first person narrative because first person narration heightens suspension and first person narrators are always unreliable and you know how much I love unreliable characters. I also think the ending was a little bit convoluted. We do get more questions than we do answers which is what the author wants to bring to our attention and think about these issues. However, the ending was was murky, but I guess it ended on a happier note, although I would have liked to see the ending be a little bit more tragic instead of having everybody- Anyway, this is my review of Six Wakes by Mer Lafferty. I really like Mer Lafferty. I like her writing. I hope to see more of her writing in science fiction and fantasy books. And I would like to read Six Wakes a second time to see if my perspective on it changes at all. I was going back and forth to see if I wanted to give this a four or a five stars. So I'm going to settle with a 4.5 stars. So there you have it. That's my review of Six Wakes by Mer Lafferty. If you liked my review, please give it a thumbs up and please let me know down in the comments if you have read Six Wakes and tell me what you thought about it. And don't forget to subscribe for more science fiction fantasy book reviews. Until next time, happy reading. Who are you? I'm Shay. No, I'm Shay. Bye!